Hey, welcome to this episode of the Ever Black Podcast. My guest on the show is Lala, drummer of Swiss All Girl Traditional Metal Sensations, Burning Witches, who will be releasing their new album, Dance with the Devil, via Nuclear Blast, this Friday, March 6th. The album is absolutely phenomenal, and uh, it's great to drive to. Lala is also uh, just an amazing drummer, and she uh, just really cool to hang with. She had heaps to say about, uh, obviously, the new album, their new singer, Laura, who is just absolutely kicking ass on this album. There's so many layers to her vocals. And, of course, are playing Varkin Festival and uh, what they've got planned for the near future. Go pre-order it now. Uh, you won't regret it. It's a really, really good album, and I really hope to see them in Australia in the near future because uh, everything I've seen of them live is just absolutely uh, amazing. All right, before we go into this episode, I just need to give a shout-out to our good friends at Blacklight Art Design who are a go-to for all our screen printing needs. They do shirts, hats, patches, you name it. If you can wear it, they can print it. They've done all our shirts and hats forever, Black Media, and they're awesome guys. Shout out to them, www.blacklightad.com.au. show is also brought to you by our good friends at RW Promotion, who are the best in the biz when it comes to stickers, flyers, banners, badges, and all other promo you need for your band or business. Go check them out at www.rwpromotion.com.au. Also want to give a shout out to our friends at the occult clothing brand Electric Witch, who have just an amazing range of apparel and if you like things on the darker side they are definitely for you check out their whole range at www.electricwitch.com.au don't forget to subscribe to the ever black podcast through itunes podcast spotify spreaker youtube and facebook and check out all our reviews and articles at www.everblackmedia.com.au Like us on all the socials and uh, swing us a message because we like saying hi. All right, here is my chat with Lala from Burning Witches. Get their new album, Dance with the Devil, this Friday through Nuclear Blast. Turn it up loud. Horns high. Enjoy. Lala, how are you? I'm great. Yeah, and you? Do you have beer in your hands? I don't. I had before. I was just. I've just come from band rehearsal, so I'm sweaty, smelly mess, and I've got uh, some water. But I had a beer there, so at least that gave me a, a head oh, start. Oh, you're great. You're also in the band. Yeah. So what so, instrument are you playing? I sing. Well, wow. Yeah. I yelp. hear that. Huh? <laughs> I hear that. <laughs> But we're not here to talk about my band, of course. Uh, we're here to talk about Burning Witches. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I'm ready. Absolutely. <laughs> so first of all, where the hell are you in the world right now? We're in uh, Switzerland. Three girls are from Switzerland. And Burning Witches is originally, I mean, based in Brook, Switzerland. Mm. And since uh, we have a new lineup, two of our members are residing in Holland. So it's a half-half, you know. But anyway, it's still burning witches, so absolutely everything is uh, perfect. <laughs> see, and it's not, I guess, for over there, it's not that far to go for everyone, is it? No, you you have to to, to fly at least an hour. So the thing we're gonna do is, uh, if we have, have a band session, they will come here and uh, we will do everything uh, as so we can because that's the only time that uh, we're all together. Everything we we can from for the for the band. So it's a little bit busy. Expect the busy days if they're here. And that's a good thing, though. I mean, especially mm-hmm. man, with this new Burning Witches album, Dance with the Devil, it comes out on March 6th. Man, this album is killer. Killer? Really? Okay, nice to hear that. Thank you so much. It's kind of catchy, right? And it's dangerous to drive to as well. <laughs> oh, don't listen to Lucid Nightmare <laughs> <laughs> while you're driving. It's, it's going to be a fast train. <laughs> I did. I did. And I had to watch myself. And it's that, yeah, it's such an amazing album. You guys have done such a good job. Oh, thank you so much. Because our, you know, we we just love what we're doing. And our motivation is 120%. And the chemistry is there. Sisterhood and uh, all of the funny things. We're joking together. Laugh at each each other's uh, jokes. And that's, that's the most important thing. Yeah, enjoy each other's company. Yeah, well... Making music. And you can hear that. And that's the mm-hmm. thing. You know, <laughs> fans put out albums, they, they you know, you can, it, it's it's good, it's heavy, but uh, it's it's missing some elements. And that's where I did pick up. 
all those things that you pointed out and that sisterhood, you know, that mm-hmm. you enjoy each other's company, you enjoy jamming and riding with each other. It shows yeah. totally. Yeah, totally. Because uh, having a band is not only 100% music. It's kind of like 50-50. Mm. Even if you play technical stuff and you have this bad attitude or you don't belong there, you don't enjoy each other, it will not going to work at the end of the day. And then, yeah, if if if, if the, the bonding is there, the laughter is there, I mean, you, you will forget the time. Oh, come on, let's go home. Okay, let's go in the bar first to have a have a beer, <laughs> something like that. And that's important. It is it. It's it's really important for a band to keep together like that. And of course, Dance with the Devil is album number three for you guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah, what unbelievable. The... Yeah. <laughs> and in such a short amount of time, you guys have done so much. What was the starting off point writing this album? I mean, the Roman is crazy of making songs, and then before we 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 make this album, we recorded. Um, I mean, before Dance with the Devil, um, but we already had at least four to five songs, and it's not that hard for us to to complete a new album. So we decided to record it and have a full length again. Because mm-hmm. Romana is uh, her ideas is limitless. In fact, uh, two weeks ago she told me that, uh, "Hey Lala, I have a new idea for the new song. Come on, give me a break because we haven't <laughs> released yet the the Dance with the Devil, and you're telling me that you have something. Come on, we can try. We can try. And let's let's go in the in the band room and try it out. Yeah, we tried it out. Two songs, <laughs> and then yesterday she sent me again another one. Oh, Romana, it's a great idea for the intro, yeah? Let's make another Dark Companion again. In the first album, we have a song called Dark Companion, and yes. it has a nice intro. And, then, and this intro yesterday was great. Yeah. See, that's, that's incredible that, you know, you've got that inspiration there. And it sounds yeah, like you're gonna yeah. have a new album by the end of the end of the year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the friendship are there. I mean, you cannot get rid of each other's faces. Even yeah. Laura and uh, Sonia is outside Switzerland, and then of mm. course we're gonna we will we are missing them, but we cannot do uh, do much. So that's the reason that if we're if they're here, we do everything we can for the band and uh, and they spend time together. Yeah, and. Uh, yeah, no, not much pressure. Just enjoy the time, enjoy in, while it lasts. Because, uh, come on, uh, why, uh, strike while the ar- iron is hot. You, you know what I mean? Absolutely. <laughs> it's just like uh, if the motivation is there, come on, do do what you can. Because all the ideas will come out. There's no pressure, and it's so it's just easy and have some fun. Fun is so important. And you've got Ross the Boss on the album too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, because uh, uh, Romana is a friend of Bros, and uh, she asked, and she's also a big fan of Manowar, and she asked, you know, mm. play in battle him, please? And then uh, he said that, okay, sure, sure, why not? And she, he, he, didn't, he didn't think twice. And the good thing is he encouraged uh, Michael Lapont to play the bass, and it ended up really cool, really, really cool. We love, we love it. I mean, I mean, we love, we love how how it it ended up, and it's just like sounds, yeah, we, it sounds really good, and I think we 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 had a good uh, what's that? We we had a good tribute to pay respect to our heroes. And I can hear that as well. I mean, you've got your own style. I, I mm-hmm. think you know when you when you put on Burning, which is sounds like Burning, but you can hear there's the DNA of your heroes throughout as well. Mm-hmm. And it's 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 a really good balance. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, uh, if if you play an instrument, no matter what kind of instrument it is, and if you have these uh, heroes in your heart, and you you play that specific instrument, it's automatically come out. It's it's just like. Uh, 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 what's that? The f- expression of yourself. Mm. But, I mean, you're not copying, but it's automatically come this this uh, style of music, just like priest and maiden. Yeah. Of course, I mean, your new vocalist Laura is incredible, uh, and I love the way she uses her voice to, in a way, tell tell story by ch- channeling different personalities and and characters in a way. I mean, she's got so many layers. Mm, H- how do yeah. you find her? Yeah. Yeah, she she's a kind of girl that has a lot of ideas to sing. 
I mean, if you will listen to one specific song, there are, there are aggressiveness, there are melodic voice, especially the chorus, and then the idea of uh, changing the vocal range to high and uh, and then low uh, low range. It's it's amazing, and uh, she's the kind of girl that uh, really funny, especially if she's drunk. I love her when she's <laughs> drunk <laughs> because she's so unbelievable funny, and she has a lot of jokes. And then. Uh, she is really down to earth and uh, easy, easy, easy to work with. Yeah. We're lucky. We're so fortunate having Laura. Yeah, she's amazing. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I, I love what she does. I was, I, I keep hearing every time I go back and listen to the album, I hear more and more little things that she throws in. It's um mm-hmm. really interesting. Yeah, she must have spent so long in the studio, like coming up with all that stuff. Because mm-hmm. she's not just singing it straight out; she's telling stories. Love it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. She, she, is, she is Laura, our new witch. Please yeah. welcome our new witch, Laura. Amazing Laura. <laughs> Absolutely. And the, the tour that, that uh, is coming up in support of the album kicks off, I believe, next week, and it is insane. The the dates are <laughs> yeah, crazy. Yeah, exactly. Wow. Look at this going. I hope hey. I can survive as a drummer. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> what a show. <laughs> Yeah, but, you, but we love touring, yeah. <laughs> how are you prepping for it? I mean, that's that's a long run crammed into one little, you know. Yeah, well you you have to be sure that you have enough sleep. I mean, if you're if you're sleeping in the bus, you will sleep at least 10 hours or longer. Mm. It depends upon the the what's the driving, how long it will take until into to, to get into the, the, the next venue. And then, yeah, most important also is the mood before playing. If you have bad mood, oh, it will be fucked up. <laughs> and <laughs> and uh, yeah, you, you have to 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 uh, to be in the mood and then. But it happens many times. Even if you're in the bad mood and you play, and once you see the people smiling at you in the crowd and enjoying and singing to your songs. All the things will will go away and it's just like, hey, hell yeah, this is fucking metal. Yeah, we're all together, something like that. You feel mm. the energy, you feel this. This is so, this is priceless. And I bet you would have felt that way as well when you uh, played some of those massive festivals. Like, fucking man, that's that's a dream for a lot of musicians. Yeah, holy festival. shit. Uh, this yeah. is holy shit, really. And <laughs> it's just the surreal that they ask, hey, can you play in walk-in? Of course. <laughs> we will not think <laughs> twice. Hell yeah. Come on, this is the ultimate dream of every band. And then we, we, we were there and then there are at least 8,000 people in the crowd. They stay, stay there since the, the beginning until in the end. They didn't went out. Of course, all uh, most of them. I mean, not everybody of them uh, uh, knows Burning Witches. But the, mm. the 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 good thing is they stay there, and uh, of course there are fans that yes, yeah, they're screaming Burning Witches and so noisy. Hey, uh, maybe at least the half doesn't know Burning Witches. But uh, yeah, fortunately, we really thank them that we stayed in the show and we then they enjoyed the show because we enjoyed it a lot. And it's uh, and that time is Laura's uh, birthday. And oh, yeah. then uh, Sonia asked the crowd, hey, can you sing happy birthday to Laura? And then everybody sing. I mean, this is pri- priceless, really. That was an amazing experience. We want to play there once again. Totally great. How was the feeling before going on stage for you? I mean, I, I know what it's like on a smaller level, but that's just fucking insane. How, insane, how yeah. are you feeling? Insane, yeah. Of course, the nervous dance are there. Adrenaline is kicking. And before, actually, I'm shaking. And I ask Roman, hey, what what's happening to me? Now, it's normal. Don't worry. Everything will be good. After three songs, your nervousness will, will, will go away. And then, yeah, it's, it happens. And, uh, I think it's normal to be nervous because if you're not nervous before playing, something is wrong, right? And, yeah. then, and then the good thing, in, if you're nervous, uh, your adrenaline will kick in and you, you have more prow- power while playing. So it's not that bad to be, ner- to be nervous before playing. Yeah, no. there are 
There's check some, your balls. There, yeah, there's some, some, uh, yeah. <laughs> check your balls and be sure that you have the defibrillator uh, <laughs> inside of you. <laughs> CPR, CPR, yo. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> but I mean, in saying that with the festivals and everything, nuclear blast, you, you, Girls have achieved so much together um, as a band, and I'm sure it hasn't been without its blood, sweat, and tears. And you mm-hmm. know, w- what's been the most challenging moment for you that you feel to overcome to get where you are now? Challenging, uh, maybe the discrimination because we're all female band, and they mm. think that we are a joke. At first, we we release a demo, and uh, we 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 sold it for sold out it for 666 copies and then after that we get recognized in two big german magazines here as a demo of the month and then for us it's unbelievable because oh yeah what's happening we're just a new band we're i think we're just uh, playing for about two years then and you have this kind of recognition so it's a good sign i think we're doing a uh, a good job because uh, with the help of the people behind us, like Shmir and Damir Escape of Gomorrah mm. and Destruction. I mean, uh, these people are uh, uh, helping us since day one, since the, the birth of Burning Witches. They are, they, are, they are our metal family. I think if it's not from them, it's hard. It will be really blood, sweat and tears, as, as you said, because... Uh, once you have this type of person who's guiding you in every step you make, yeah, it will be uh, good. And then you, they were gonna say, "Oh, go, no, 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 girls, don't go in that way. This way, please, because that way is dangerous. This way, please." So they're guiding us in many in many things. And then we're so fortunate uh, having having these two people, and of course our family is there supporting us and understand us even if we're busy. And yeah, everybody everybody is uh, uh, supporting supporting us in any anything anything even my husband is supporting me <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah 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 oh that's awesome well, that's so mm. good you know you're saying you know you've you've come up against a bit of discrimination and things like that but i guess in a lot of ways that is a sign that you're heading in the right path because you've got those people you're proving them wrong you know and you have done and you're winning mm. over fans worldwide so yeah. it's those challenges yeah. i guess are worth it in the end you know what i mean yeah Oh, yeah, I know what you mean. And then, yeah, there's a good thing and uh, and bad things, but most things are happening is at least 90% good. And uh, how? Do, why do you care about discrimination, right? And That's then right. At, least, at least people love you and stays with you since day one. And yeah, this is so priceless for us. And then we are so thankful for the fans that uh, our truly devoted fans really... We love them so much, and uh, we're making sure every time we play outside, every every time we play in the show, we're making sure that uh, we have enough time for them, signing autographs and having a picture and talk to them, have a chit-chat. And, yeah, we love what we're doing because uh, we owe something to them and because we're, we will not be here if nobody listens to your music, right? That's right. That's, mm-hmm. that's right. And mm-hmm. are you finding that people are coming up with uh, burning witches tattoos and stuff like that? Yeah, we have. We have. <laughs> it's that's unbelievable. Awesome. It's it's also uh, for us. It's uh, kind of like uh, uh, weird, but uh, yeah, it's but it's the same time we're happy and it's an honor that uh, how can you make a tattoo because your tattoo it's in your body for will be it will be forever there and you have this burning witches tattoo and yeah we have a huge respect to these people thank you so much that is awesome that is mm-hmm. it's the highest compliment and another one is are you getting you know, people coming up, like young kids coming up, young girls even coming up and saying that, you know, they're, they've they been inspired by you to play and, yes, and yes, pursue actually. that. Yeah, actually, it happens many times. 
as young as nine year old. And then uh, one girl came to me and uh, I think it's in the festival in Germany and she, she wants to have my drumsticks. Wow. And then the father is there and then I, and I give her the, my drumsticks and, and then the father asked me, what can you say about my, 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 uh, my child? She is also a girl. And then I said, I told her that don't be shy be and practice very well because at the end of the day it will be it will paid off mark my word and you will remember me for that just continue what you're doing because you love what you're doing and then it's so unbelievable that they can listen to burning witches mm. as young as this age nine year old there are girls there are boys wow so 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 amazing that's incredible i mean that that is something that you know money can't buy I mean, yes, exactly. you influencing exactly. people like that, you know, like, I don't know if you've got kids. I've got, I've got kids and my daughter, I was sitting there watching, uh, you know, she's five, but I was sitting there watching Alice Cooper's over here in the country at the moment and Nita Strauss is up there playing and she was just glued to the screen, you know, and it's that. That little spark in people, you know, that's all. Crazy, that that's, spark. yeah, that's the start. That's the start of the the, the, the thing you will gonna see to your child. Oh, wow, she, she is now listening to Alice Cooper. And how about in after ten years or twenty years, <laughs> she 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 will do many things. And the, this is the, I mean the. They said metal is uh, in the demon world or something like that because <laughs> Al, or Alice Cooper is wearing the makeup or something like that, but. But you know, at the end of the day, it's all about music, and uh, it's a really good instrument. And music helps you a lot in everyday life, and uh, it's so powerful uh, energy that uh, it's, there's a powerful energy that they're giving into you, and it's the best therapy ever. So it's a good time. Congratulations, your daughter will Thanks. kick ass someday. <laughs> oh, thank you. I appreciate that. I hope so. I hope so. She follows her old man. Like, uh, you know, I'm going to start cranking some burning witches in the car for her now. I'm starting to ease her into it. She'll, uh, and I'll see which instrument she wants to play. <laughs> Who yeah, knows? let's Who see. Knows? Let's see if, if she plays comfortable with the guitar or the bass or the drums. That's her choice. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least, <laughs> yeah. You listening to Alice Cooper, five year old? Not bad. <laughs> see how we go. <laughs> Are we on the radio, by the way? Uh, it's not live. It's it's mm -hmm. pre-recorded and everything. So, but I'm enjoying the chat. Uh, I hope yeah, I'm I enjoy you up. <laughs> yeah, I enjoyed also, and thank you so much. Uh, uh, the things that I, I will, I want to say to the to our fans in Australia is, uh, thank you so much. We love you, and uh, thank you for being with us, staying with Burning Witches, and listening to our songs. Check out our new album because it packed with good stuff in there. You will not regret it. Thank Absolutely. you so much. <laughs> That's all right. Well, uh, are we got in saying that? Are we going to see you down here soon? We better see uh, you down we here We still soon. don't know, but hopefully, come on, Australia is a beautiful country and it is one of the best uh, country that we want to play with because we know that you have a big scene there and the metal is really alive and the Aust Australia is big and I hope, I hope, we really hope that uh, we can play there and burn the stage and make our and see our fans happy faces while we're playing and singing to our songs well until then my friend we're going to keep the beers cold for you and uh we can't wait to see it of course the new album uh dance with the devil comes out march 6 through nuclear blast la la have a great tour mate yeah thank you so much thank you Dave. it'll it'll it will be great tour maybe there are cool guys so and also we will we will be in uh, um, Great Britain with Cor Piclani. It will also be great. Awesome. Well, thanks again for taking the time to hang out. Hey, it's uh, it's been awesome talking to you, mate. Thank you. Uh, oh, awesome. Yeah, I feel so comfortable. Thank you so much. I think you're a cool guy. <laughs> oh, shucks. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you so much. Thank you, mate. Listen to Lucid Nightmare and don't forget to dance with the devil. <laughs> All of the above. <laughs> See you, mate. See you. Hell yeah. Bye. Yeah, bye. bye.